bad thing to the car. Well, it was a good thing. It was a bad thing. Come check it out. More diagnostics. Bump from the back. Just winding it up. <laughs> full maximum. Full. Full asbun. Full asbun, yeah, that's, that's the plan, isn't it? <laughs> George is just making a couple adjustments to mine. He just put the new VNT turbo on it and it has made a massive difference to what I had before. I don't really know much about them, but it's made a big difference. So I put my one that was on this onto this. That's a bit of a sleeper now. And we are gonna do it up in the future, but it's done this now. But look, it's had a very boring day today. Sat in the car, bore out of his mind, wanting a beer, that's all he wants. That's all I want right now. We're back here again at Strathenge. Strathen Engineering, very good land of garage, and they've hosted us today for this whole day of remaps. It's been ideal. Well, I might as well just do a wee video on what I've done to it over the weekend. Worth T5 inside up there. So I've got their new Race VNT Turbo. I think there's only, he said there's only two in the UK just now. So I had the Race VNT Turbo before, and I had uh, not a custom exhaust, but I got the exhaust moved back and welded up whereas this one's a lot bigger and it sits even further back than the other VNT because it's a newer one and it doesn't match up to my custom exhaust so just now I put a straight pipe up straight out of it and obviously that means I can't put my bonnet on I'm gonna get something welded up but I haven't managed to yet and I know this is not ideal having this right here next to that but there's nothing I can really do um, at the moment, I'm not really using it. It needs to be kept under cover, obviously, while uh, the bonnet's not on. So in the meantime, I've got a wee pint glass, which I put over here, and I cover it with a towel. And I do need to go out on it, but I don't use it as a daily car, so it doesn't really matter. It just sits here for the time being. Impression, first impressions off this turbo were incredible. I did have the race VNT turbo before from him, from CR Turbos, but this whatever has changed about it i don't have a clue but it's a lot different and it's uh, made a big difference to it so my old turbo has gone into another defender which is a bit of a sleeper just now it's not been done up at all um, and i've got the new one in this yesterday when i was coming back um i know it's not actually spitting flames but it was glowing red hot the fumes out of here i think it's unburnt carbon which is coming out of it or it's very high temperatures coming out but but what I thought I'd let us do is I'll go out and try and get some footage off it, test it, try and get some audio off it so you can have a look at it and see what it's like. We've got a classic Scottish weather, pouring down with rain. Hopefully there's not too much wind noise, but we'll soon find out. I'm going to let it start her up, let her warm up, and then we'll head out.
I gather that's probably the most poorly put together video you've ever seen this channel. Um, it's put together by myself and not Dan for once. Um, it was filmed about two or three months ago. I've not had a chance to edit it. I thought I'd try and edit it. I'll do we finish her now. Um, the car is pretty much in the exact same position as it was two months ago. It still doesn't have a bonnet and it still doesn't have an exhaust. It's got a lot more problems with it though. It's got leaking hub seals and I do want to do a lot of work to it. I just, one, don't have the money at the moment and don't have the time to do to put into it. So I do want to do a lot of stuff to it, but just not a chance yet. So that will be coming soon, but hopefully you enjoyed all the updates of the new turbo straight through exhaust pipe and out the, out the bonnet and a lot more to come. We've finally hit a thousand subscribers, which is very cool. So that's a, a big part of our channel history. So we are going to be giving away this car, which has also sat here for the last three months. But we're going to work that out in the next week, how we're going to give it away. I'm going to get down to the garage and get them to do it up, sort of, for me. And I suppose put it through its MOT so the person can drive it away when they do win it. So I suppose that's quite exciting. And there's a couple more giveaways coming as well. Got a couple more things to give away. And big things to come but i hope you enjoyed that last video of the defender there will be more defender stuff there'll be more other stuff um but i thought there's a wee update for just now i forgot to say as well we are or we did just test drive the new defender v8 it was very cool dan's actually editing that video i filmed it which surprised me dan's editing it and i think it'll be a very very cool video so that'll be up next week this one will hopefully be up on monday and this is saturday now i suppose we'll see you on the new defender video Make sure please like, comment and subscribe. Keep up to date with all the channel updates.